हेलो पीपल वेलकम बैक दिस क्वेश्चन इज फ्रॉम गेट 2018 एग्जाम इट इज फॉर टू मार्क्स दे हैव गिवन यू दिस फंक्शन क्वेश्चन इज इफ वी कॉल दिस फंक्शन फन एंड पास टू रेज टू द पावर 40 एज पैरामीटर व्हाट इज द वैल्यू दैट विल बी रिटर्न इट इज गिवन इन द क्वेश्चन दैट अ अनसाइंड लॉन्ग इंटीजर इज ऑफ 64 बिट्स नाउ द फंक्शन नेम इज फन इट्स रिटर्न टाइप इज अनसाइंड लॉन्ग इंटीजर and it expects a unsigned long integer as parameter parameter name is n we are passing 2 raised to the power 40 to n and n is of 64 bits so it is capable of storing such values okay now first line of this program says unsigned long integer i j and sum so you are declaring these values first thing is n is declared and it is assigned a value to power 40 because we have passed to power 40 then i j and sum will be declared j and sum they will be initialized with value 0 like this okay then in next line you have written a for loop for i is equal to n so initial value of i it will be 2 power 40 then condition is i is greater than 1 body of loop is j plus plus and update expression is i is equal to i by 2 let us see how many times are we going to enter this loop and how many times will this body of loop be executed okay see initially i is 2 power 40 so i is equal to 2 power 40 it is greater than 1 that means you are going to execute j++ i am marking a tick here for j++ then you will update the value of i i will become i by 2 so if you divide it by 2 you will get the new value of i as 2 raised to the power 39 it is still greater than 1 hence you will enter the loop and execute j++ it will keep on happening i will become 2 raised to the power 38 2 raised to the power 37 so on eventually i will become 2 raised to the power 1 okay now 2 raised to the power 1 is still greater than 1 that means this time also you will enter the body of loop and you are going to execute j++ so now you can see when you just try to execute the next iteration of this for loop i will become i by 2 that means i will become 2 raised to the power 0 now i will become 2 raised to the power 0 see 2 divided by 2 is 1 2 raised to the power 0 means 1 so you are not going to enter the loop because 1 is not greater than 1 this condition becomes false so you will come out of the loop okay in total you have entered the loop 40 times that means you have executed this line 40 times so initially j was 0 executing j++ 40 times means after this loop the value of j will be 40 okay like this now let's see what is this loop doing initialization expression is empty that means nothing will be executed as initialization line next line is j must be greater than 1 now the value of j currently is 40 40 is greater than 1 that means condition is true so you will enter the loop okay so you will enter the loop that means you are going to execute some plus plus currently j is equal to 40 which is greater than 1 so you are going to enter the loop then j is equal to j by 2 40 by 2 means 20 so 20 is greater than 1 you will enter the loop then again you will divide it by 2 so 10 greater than 1 enter the loop then divide it by 2 j will become 5 5 is still greater than 1 you will enter the loop then the value will become 2.5 2.5 will be treated as 2 because see j is an integer okay you can save only integers so 0.5 will be neglected and you will take only integer part it is greater than 2 so enter the loop you will again execute this then j is equal to j by 2 will be executed j will now become 1 and you will not enter the loop because this condition is false okay now because this condition is false you are going to come out of the loop 
सो इन टोटल हाउ मेनी टाइम्स हैव यू एग्जीक्यूटेड दिस वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव एग्जीक्यूटिंग सम प्लस प्लस फाइव टाइम्स मीन्स यू हैव इंक्रीमेंटेड द वैल्यू ऑफ सम बाय फाइव Initially it was zero. So after execution of this loop, sum will be how much? Five. Now you execute this line return sum. That means you are returning this variable. Its value is five. So the value that is returned is five. Answer to this question is five. C. Return type of this function was unsigned long integer, and sum is a variable of type unsigned long integer. Its value is five. That is returned. Answer is five. Okay.